Do you remember this TikTok's gel lady? Let's put some gel in the swoopy swoop. I'm gonna go finish the rest off camera and I'll be right back. Bam! All right, what do you guys think? Do we like this swoopty swoop? She became famous after showing everyone how she put gel on her hair before she goes to work in a military. This gained her not only hundreds nor thousands, but millions of followers. She even started her own gel brand. Where should I put my shoes? I'm amor, I'm amor. You say, put them on your head. I'm amor, I'm amor. And now she is trending again, not because of her gel, but because of her husband. Yes, you heard it right. Because as it turns out, her husband was cheating on her. And trust me, you wouldn't want to miss this hot tea because she decided discovered this in the worst way possible. Ashley is a TikToker from US who works in the military. She became popular after showing off her skills in making her hair flawless by using a gel. But she's not just any kind of popular because her gel videos made her gain millions of followers. Because of this, more and more people became invested. Not only with her videos, but also with her life. Because when she began including her husband in her videos like this, let's think how my husband would react if another woman flirts with him. Her viewers immediately loved them and painted them as a cute couple. You guys are the best. I I love this couple so much. Never leave her side. That's pure love. But one day her viewers were alarmed because they observed an unusual thing in one of Ashley's videos. He's gonna be the hardworking man he is and he's gonna take care of us. Now imagine 20 years later, he finds somebody else that's younger, more beautiful, and he leaves you. And even though she clearly stated that this is just her what ifs and biggest fear, she cannot stop her fans from worrying about her relationship. So they immediately asked her and this is what she said. You guys, this is not my situation right now. I was just telling you the reason I will always work. But her followers didn't buy this explanation and decided to take matters into their own hands by investigating what's really happening. And this is when they noticed that videos of her and her husband were no longer available in her profile, which Ashley also addressed by saying this. But I did start this channel by myself in 2020. I've always loved being on social media and he did not. Ashley explained that they decided to take down their couple videos since her husband was no longer comfortable with him being on social media. But this explanation of Ashley did little to nothing for her because things took a turn for the worse when people saw this video. Say hi, Daddy. Say hi, Daddy. Hi, Daddy. Whose goddamn white baby is that? This is your baby, okay? He's just light-skinned it. Mm -hmm. Because of this, Ashley's followers went insane and became really concerned about her. They flooded her with messages about this video, thinking that her husband has a child with this woman named Monique. But here's an even bigger plot twist. The guy in the video is just a lookalike of Ashley's husband. And while this calms Ashley's viewers, this is not the end of the story yet. Because Monique then proceeded to spill out hot tea. And trust me, it is a small world after all. Because Monique turns out to be an adult entertainer, and Ashley's husband turned out to be one of her clients. And, believe it or not, she seemed to be so proud of it. I don't feel like this man is heard, and now I feel like he's being slightly bashed on the internet. And if you think that this is crazy enough, you are wrong, because Monique came to be aware of Ashley and her husband's relationship all this time. For everybody doing the favor of tagging her, can you see any of the tags on somebody's video that you blocked? But even though this drama was so messy, Ashley kept her head up high and became the bigger person. And the last way I want you guys to show your support is by bullying this person or threatening this person. I don't want that. I have nothing against her. This is something me and my husband need to figure out. And even after all these, it seems like this issue won't die down anytime soon because it looks like Monique is still enjoying the attention. So for now, let's just hope for the best for Ashley.